Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. So I'm here today to answer a very important question. Uh, where has Fallout been? Um, I'll start with the most important part. Uh, you probably noticed that my voice sounds a little bit different, and if you've watched any of my other series, um, you'll know that my regular microphone, the one that I've been using for the last like two years, uh, has developed a very annoying like buzzing sound. I don't know what's causing it. I've determined that it's got to be coming from the microphone. Um, I'm going to try a few things, see if I can't get it working again. Um, if not, then unfortunately I just have to use the webcam mic that I usually have just kind of lying around um, until this one gives out on me or go out and buy a new microphone, which I'm probably going to end up having to do anyway. But, you know, like I said, it was used. Um, I haven't dropped it or messed with it, but, you know, it wasn't exactly in pristine shape when I bought it. Uh, there's no telling how the person who had it before me, you know, what they did with it or whatever. So um, that's the most, that's the biggest part of why I haven't been around on Fallout. Uh, the second thing is I was sort of waiting for some of the DLC stuff, stuff to come out, but uh, primarily I was waiting for the GEC to come out to, um, ah, okay, um, to, uh, work on a few things, uh, kind of freehand. But uh, the problem we have is I can't get the mod that I've been working on to work properly. So, yes, I'm using the const commands, but that's the only way I can get this. And that's the only way I can test this out. And I will show you what I've been working on and what I've been trying to get functioning. So the problem is... Like, I've lost, like, I don't have the sound. Um, I have the effects right, but the sound is wrong. And also, it's a dedicated weapon. It's not a, uh, it's not a mod that you can put on so it's not a craftable item that you can put onto your weapons. And that's kind of what I'm working on. Um, I know that the creation kit is still in beta form. So, I mean, there's probably still some stuff that's not fully functioning just yet. So, I mean, I haven't really been uh, too worried about it. But... Yeah, that's the Assaultron Beam Laser. Right, but as you can hear, it's still making the minigun sound. Uh, also, this is not my uh, usual playing world. This is my... Uh, this is my, hey, I'm just going to kind of mess around world. You know, this is where a lot of my cheating happens. Uh, let's see, what's a good place that's gonna definitely have something, uh, fun to fight. Uh, I'm actually gonna leave this loading screen in. Uh, first off, to show you guys how long it takes for my loading screens. Watch this one actually go fairly quickly. Uh, and also, like I said, see, fairly quickly. Like I said, you know, these things... Okay, good, I don't have to censor her out. Um, like I said, I am going to be getting back into Fallout. I don't have Far Harbor. Um, I will be getting Far Harbor as soon as the uh, money has been made available to me to get Far Harbor. Uh, by that, I mean as soon as the bank that has that has my money transfers the money to the bank that I can easily access which that won't happen for 
That usually doesn't happen for a week because, you know, they're jerks. Um, I've got some other stuff I need to take care of first, you know, mostly just bills and things. And then, uh, depending on how much I have left over, uh, we'll determine whether or not I'll be able to get Far Harbor this week or whether or not it'll be next week. Um, if I can get the audio to come out fine, I should hopefully start recording Fallout again. Wow, there are no enemies in this game. I should start recording it again, probably <clears throat> at the latest. Ah, there we go. Hey, buddy boy. Ah, he won. That's always what that's why I've always liked the uh, Gatling. But because some of you guys are wondering what this thing is going to look like in VAT, though I never use the VAT system, though I'm not a big fan of the VAT system, though I don't really care that much for the VAT system, I'll use it in VAT so you guys can see what it does, what it looks like from the, uh, the VAT screen. Um, I believe, so we went to the diner and we were down round about this area. So we'll do that again. And, uh, yeah, like I said, um, I've been working on this. I want to make this a, uh, attachment that basically once you get the Gatling laser, you switch out the barrel and, like, all you have to do is just, like, switch out the barrel and you get the beam, you know, we'll probably make it like science three or something like that. And you know, I want to do this like kind of proper and make it very and make it a little bit more fun and interesting. Um, I've never made a mod before, so you know, just getting to the point where this thing actually fires is you know a huge step for me. Now, also, it would probably help if I had my actual armor on. Can I show that? I guess we're going to find out, aren't we? So, bear with me for just a second while I... Not perfect, but it'll work. So yeah, I will show you guys what this thing looks like in VAT. Cause I'm sure it probably looks pretty cool. So hang on. Gotta let my AP points come back up because, you know. I can't use VAT without it. So yeah, like I said, mostly it's just, you know, I've had a lot of stuff like come up all at once and I really haven't had a lot of uh, interest in recording. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, that's all I can get out of this. Yeah. Damn it, Curie. Oh, that's why. I thought he had a gas in there. I mean, I thought you had the... So basically, that's what it looks like in VAT. Now, it does still sort of have the same hitbox. Um, I might try and make it a little bit more accurate. You know? So... Oops. And I'm also probably going to end up slowing it down. But I think I'll keep the damage around about the same. I might increase it a little bit. So, I mean, the thing is, this thing is supposed to, like, it's meant to shred through, so. I believe we're supposed to file a police report, yes? 
and all the little things go in baggies for evidence. Fusion core, fusion core. Hmm. It's out here. Just in case. Okay, we're good. Never be too careful. Yes, I do have some of those mods installed, so. So, that's basically what I've been doing. Um, hopefully, at some point, I can get this this working properly. Like I said, I don't know why. Like, I've tried making adjustments to the sounds, but I think the creation kit is just not... It doesn't have the ability to do certain things at this time. And uh, that's part of the reason why, like, I can't get the sound effect. Because I want the actual Assaultron beam sound effect. And, uh... I, like I said, I also want to make it. I want to make it a barrel mod. I, st I think I, I think a barrel mod. I haven't decided whether want to be want it to be like a barrel mod or a lens mod. Uh, but I think it's probably the barrel that has the lens focus thing. So actually, let's jump back to which place can I go to that is safe. Uh, <clears throat> ah, screw it. We'll jump to the red rocket, and if it's not safe, well, then you'll just see some black bars somewhere. But it should be fairly safe, I think. At least safe enough. But yeah, like I said, that's 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 what I've been up to. Is so if we go over here to the weapons workbench, and we now for this, I'm actually do want to select the Gavin Wave. So yeah, I was thinking about making it the, uh, one of the lens receivers. You know, so it would have uh, superior damage and uh, better accuracy would be the two books that I would end up adding to it. And I figure I'd probably make it like, so it'd probably be somewhere in this range. So you would need like Science 3 and probably uh, Gun Nut 3 in order to uh, in order to actually access it. So I mean it wouldn't exactly be you know bam early on you could just you know grab it and go but I mean if it turns out that I can't actually do uh, do this the way I want to then uh, most likely what will happen is I will just uh, I kind of leave it as like a standalone mod and give a little story behind why it's its own separate separate thing and probably places somewhere like the um, uh, oh what is the Minuteman base the big fortress I don't remember the name of it uh, where you end up having to fight the Marler Queen right so it would be something like you know their R and D department you know. Or something like that. Uh, but I will be working continuously to try and make sure this thing does work. Does work properly. So, um, yeah. So that's where I've been. That's what I've been doing. Uh, hopefully I can get everything <clears throat> squared away fairly soon. And like I said, worst case scenario, I'll just give Far Harbor and uh, start recording again. Best case scenario, I actually get this mod working. I could probably start recording before Far Harbor. So, um that's it uh i am done for the day hopefully you guys will see more fallout content pretty soon um and to that i'm gonna say sayonara